Are you or your family member attending college this year? Whether you're attending college in or out of state, SMZBT wants to encourage you on your journey. You are cordially invited to the SMZBT Outbound College Luncheon on Sunday, August the 5th, immediately after the 10 a.m. service in the Fellowship Hall. Great information will be shared and a great meal will be prepared. Call the church office to reserve your seat. We hope you can attend. SMZBT is partnering with SEEDS, strengthening families through support, supplies, and structure to support their seventh annual Back to School Family and Community Resource Fair. This fair will be held on Saturday, August the 11th from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. Parents and students are invited to come out to one of the following back to school sites for workshops and school supplies. Aberdeen and Bassett Elementary, Empowered Believers, First Baptist Church of Hampton and Memorial Baptist Church, North Phoebus and YH Thomas Community Centers. SMZBT is currently collecting school supplies for this program. There are bins located in the lobby for your donation. For more information and to know what supplies are needed, pick a flyer on your way out or call the church office. Youth, are you ready for some fun under the big top? The Youth Development Ministry of SMZBT will head to the Universal Soul Circus on Saturday, July the 28th for their 25th anniversary show. Transportation will leave SMZBT at 10 a.m. and return at 5 p.m. Tickets are only $25, which includes transportation and admission to the circus. A lunch stop will be made before returning to church. Parents, please make sure your youth has money for lunch. Limited tickets for the youth only event will be sold in the bookstore every Sunday after the 10 a.m. service. Adults, if you would like to be a chaperone, please contact Minister Bland, Deacon Ashby, or Barbara Joe. Congratulations to Rory Nixon for being selected to the second team All Arena Football League as a fullback. Good morning, church. My name is Phyllis Richardson, and I'm the lifestyle coach for the type 2 diabetes program that is held on Saturdays. And first, I would like to thank, thank all of you for rallying together and getting the participants for the class. We are now in session six, and we have folks who have made positive lifestyle changes. They are increasing their activity. They are eating less, losing pounds to prevent type two diabetes. Also, I would like to thank Pastor Barber for not only being concerned about our spiritual health, but our physical health as well by allowing this program to come to the community. So now, stay tuned and listen to some testimony from some of the participants. Hi, I want you to know that I really enjoyed the class. I've been in the class now, this is my fifth week, and out of the fifth week, I lost six pounds. I don't know how many inches I lost, but I lost a lot of inches. Thank you to Phyllis and her team. This class has helped me tremendously in the efforts to watching what I eat. Um, I love sweets, so I've learned different apps, different ways to control what I eat. And by putting food in the app and logging our food every day, it makes me mindful of what I eat every day. So um, I'm down six pounds. Everything's going great. Wish me luck. I've been in the class from the beginning. Um, I have I started a weight, a certain weight, and I've actually lost um, about four or five pounds. Gain some back, but I actually lost more. It's actually changed my plans as far as eating, doing more exercise, and it's just changed my overall outlook on life. Hello, my name is Tears Amora, and I'm a Zumba instructor. I come out to participate in the diabetes program and get everybody moving. Moving is very important, and if you can have fun while you're doing it, why not? Let's praise God and glorify Him and get moving, get healthy. We can do it. Amen. Mission Sunday. M is for the Meals on Wheels ministry that takes place every Thursday. I is for the international ministry of Six Mount Zion Baptist Temple. S is for serving meals to the less fortunate every third Thursday. S is for the sick and shut-in members that we care for. 
I is for the infants and children that are receiving medical treatments and education around the world. O is for the oppressed being delivered throughout the preached word. N is for the nursing home we serve on Algonquin Drive every fourth Saturday. S is for sharing Christ with the world with our resources. July 29th is Mission Sunday. What will you give to keep the mission going? For more information concerning any of these announcements, please call the church office at 896-6050 or visit our website at smzbt.org or join us on Facebook and Twitter. You can catch our services live on Facebook using our church app or your Facebook account. And that's your weekly announcements for the temple at a glance. Oh.